Michael, the Home Depot trade is seen as an economic bellwether for the U.S. economy. Take us through what's going to be important for you. Yeah, I think uh, the story is going to be one still of a back half recovery. I don't think we're going to see much better numbers uh, in the first quarter versus what we saw at the end of last year, which is to say still negative same for sales. We're a little bit less negative than consensus. We think we might get a slight beat, but still negative comps. We think the read for the second quarter will be negative as well. The company will talk about a back half recovery. That was their original guidance for the year. It's too early in the year to change that. But we're not yet seeing that recovery again. It's going to be pushed out to the second half of the year. All right. So it's spring for a variety of reasons for home improvement retailers, a key season. Uh, summer is also key for a certain other variety of reasons, given home improvement and gardening and outside activities and everything else. What is the outlook going to look like and what was the outlook that you would be looking to hear from Home Depot about what's going to come in this current quarter and beyond? Yeah, we hate to be so myopically focused on the short term, but what they say about May uh, is going to be really important. Again, that's the first month of the second quarter. There's been a lot of noise in the months uh, so far this year. You have Leap Day, you have the early Easter, uh, tax refunds were delayed, the weather hasn't been great. So a lot of volatility in the monthly trends. It will be important to hear how they exited the first quarter and how the second quarter is starting off. But again, we think it's going to be a lot about the back half recovery. Uh, we do think rates have a lot to do with it, and, and they've been pretty sticky. So we have yet to see housing recover. Uh, existing home sales uh, pricing has been up the last few months. That's a good initial sign. But again, we think the industry trends are still negative. There's also going to be a lot of focus. Remember the acquisition that they made uh, after their last quarter report uh, within the complex pro market. We think we'll hear a lot of discussion about that as well.